Greetings, Aries. I hope you guys are doing lovely. This is going to be a monthly reading, the month of March, ladies and gentlemen, our birthday seasons, all right? This is going to be for those specifically that are single. So whether you're getting to know someone or whether you don't have someone at all, you identify as single, all right? This is who, the, who this message is directed to. So what's going on with those single Aries? Beautiful. What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? I'm going to get three more shuffles. What's going on in the month of March for those? Those areas. All right, guys. So, <clears throat> wow, what's going on? Three of swords. That's kind of hefty energy there, Aries. All right, holy mother. Lord have mercy. What's going on here? Clearly, something is not over. All right, clearly, Aries, there's been some sort of heartbreak here that is being prolonged king of cups all right what's going on so king of cups this may in fact indicate that you might have broken someone's heart yet you feel grounded all right let's go with the flow let's see what's happening here Aries, you're walking away from something you could be walking away from someone very much so all right but things may turn around, okay? The judgment can entail reconciliation at times, but that's in the far future, not this month. That's just something I wanted to note. As of now, for the month of March, there's a sense of abandonment being experienced here. All right, guys, what's going on, Aries? I just did a reading for you guys, and instead of falling in love. And now it's like disastrous. Gods of war, gods of war. Whomever it is you got to run your proximity here wants to. Turn things around, all right? The Wheel of Fortune. They're wanting to align with you in a harmonious manner. They're wanting things to shift in a positive sense here, all right? But you yourself seem to be in a massive rut that you're trying to get away from. So, guys, Aries, you could be playing your own worst enemy at this time, okay? There's so much discombobulating energy. What's going on here? We're going to get to the bottom of this, ladies and gentlemen. We are going to get to the bottom of this. Tell me about this King of Wands here. This is most certainly Aries. Tell me about this King of Wands. The Hangman. Trying to gain perspective. All right. Trying to gain perspective, Aries. <clears throat> Putting forth effort in what? Putting forth effort in what? All right. In yourself, guys. Putting effort in yourself. Aries, I get the sense that in the month of March, you could be going through something quite difficult, quite tumultuous, and it's going to really entail a lot of work, all right? You're seeking growth. You're seeking expansion. You see, when when shit, hit the, when shit hits the fan, you're not one to just sit in, in, like, in sorrow for too long, okay? Yeah, you're human, your feelings, and, you know, but you got that fire in you, and you're going to seek, I was going to say revenge, but no, don't seek revenge. You're gonna seek. You're gonna seek to vanquish whatever obstacle stands in your way, okay? And that's in, that may entail walking away from something just completely, utterly. All right, just utterly walking away from something toward growth. Tell me about this empress. Let's see. Let's see. What is this empress here? What is this empress? <clears throat> Holy shit, guys. What's going on here? I got clarified by the divine counterpart. The the emperor. <clears throat> All right. This, this is... Uh, what's going on here? Let's get to the bottom of this. All right. Yeah, guys. You see, there's a very potent, significant relationship that has been... There's been some serious investment into already. All right. But for whatever reason, there's a massive... Just... It's shrouded, guys. It's shrouded in, in a sense of obscurity. Could have been deception. Could have been deception, ladies and gentlemen. Why the Three of Swords? Why? What is the Three of Swords doing here? Three of Pentacles, guys. Why am I getting a third-party situation, Aries? Why am I getting a third-party situation here? I did say deception, and all of a sudden I get indications of a third-party situation. All right? Is this a third-party situation? Is this a, a third-party situation? Is this, is there, mm, angry, angry. All right, guys, this could be, a, it doesn't have to be a third party situation, okay? This could be a, a lack of, uh, this can very much be a lack of 
reciprocity, okay? A lack of, of just something being put forth. Whatever was being put forth was just not satisfying. It was not satisfying. It was just insignificant. And, and it, it got cut out, guys. It got cut out. It got cut out, all right? Page of Cups came about trying to express their love and all of a sudden Queen of Won't Queen of Swords just cut cut the cut it up. You know what I mean? Guys, what's going on here? I'm running out of cards. I'm running out of cards. This center, this reading is all over the place, guys. The Emperor, the Empress. We got, you know, all this sorts of energy. Alright, speak to me about the tower. What's going on here? What's going on here? What's going on with this tower? The sun. Guys, as soon as something comes to destruction, happiness lies around the corner. Alright? Transformation, guys. There's a transformation that's being hindered, Aries. And so long it's hindered, you're going to feel a very heavy energy. You're going to feel very heavy energy here. An energy of abandonment. Okay, but... I'm getting the sense that this this situation is in, in your power, guys. It's in your power. It's like where this goes lies upon your own decision. All right? The lovers. The lovers. All right? This is often associated with a decision in love. And I'm literally speaking about a decision, guys. So look, Aries, whatever tumultuousness you're going to be experiencing in your love life in the month of March is self-induced. It's not self-induced. It's self-imposed. All right? Self-imposed is what I'm getting. I mean, I, I, I just did this massive loop. All right? I did a massive loop. And, and that's the understanding that I'm coming, that I'm getting to the bottom of the line of, ladies and gentlemen. Now, this is in the month of March. You may not be experiencing this. All right, guys? You may not be experiencing this already. Um, what are they currently experiencing? Those that are watching this. What are they currently experiencing? Wow, we got another divine counterpart, ladies and gentlemen. Mind you, this is card number one. This is card number two. Okay? This is the emperor in his young age or phase. And this is the empress in her young age. Right? The, the lovers the lovers is here. Guys, you guys are dealing with something very potent. Okay? And based on all these major arcanas, this relationship is something that is destined to bring a massive learning lesson for you okay that is what i'm seeing here in the future a massive realization ladies and gentlemen a massive realization okay what this relationship turns out to be isn't necessarily what's important it's how you're navigating this and what and the, trans, the inner transformations that you are undergoing and learning from this process now this relationship may very much be saved may it be saved can this relationship can this situation be reconciled be rectified and can it be prospered? What are the potentials of that? Yes. Yes, they can. Okay? I'm telling you. I feel it. I see it. But, Aries, this is where you are. This is the energy that you're exuding. One of abandonment. One of difficulty. This is the energy your person's exuding. Positivity. All right? What's going on here, Aries? I'm, I'm going to take this to the extended, and I'm going to bore into this individual here. I'm going to bore into this individual's energy. All right, I'm going to get deep into their feelings, deep into their mind. And maybe then, maybe then you'll feel comfortable taking different actions or different choices or making choices regarding this situation. Because that's what it seems that you have difficulty uh, with, okay, during this time. Mind you, look at guys, the signs are all over the place. The potential for love here is quite apparent. Before I take this to the extended, give me any piece of advice for Aries. All right, give me any piece of advice for Aries. <clears throat> when it comes to this matter, yes, you're single. You got the world upon your hands. Nine of nine of coins. This is the pre empress, and the pre empress is only missing that last coin to be the ten of coins to be married to be established, so on and so forth. That's you, Aries. All right, but. Again, you're being your own worst enemy. You're standing strong on both your feet with a blindfold over your eyes, guys. All right. <clears throat> Give me any last piece of advice. <sighs> any words of encouragement. Any words of clarity. You got to navigate your own self, ladies and gentlemen. When it comes down to this, it requires effort. 
All right, it's not easy to balance this situation out. It's not easy to balance your own internal self. It's not easy to synchronize your thoughts with your feelings. You may have some, some beautiful feelings towards someone, all right? But your thoughts are killing you. Your thoughts are killing that. Your thoughts are standing in the way of those feelings. You align your mind with your feelings, and that's when that trinity comes about, right? That's when that duality comes together. Well, that's when those binary forces come together, and there you become a whole being. All right, you got some work to do, Aries. All right, guys, I'm a bit discombobulated myself from this reading. All right, <clears throat> this is not my reading. I know I'm an Aries, but I am not. This is not my reading. This is, I don't know who I'm tuning into, guys, but it seems as if you got love, you got love on a silver platter and you may just be abandoning it, okay? You may be, you, you just seem to be walking away from someone that wants to connect with you, Aries. I'm going to take this to the extent and I'm going to bore into this individual, all right? Their thoughts, their feelings, their actions towards you, their intentions. So if this was your reading, I'll see you there, Aries. Otherwise, guys, you guys really got to look within, whomever I'm tuning into, all right? Because you are standing in the way. You are standing in your own way. You're hindering your own self, okay? In regards to whatever it is, whether you really want to walk away or whether you want to stay in the situation, you are not doing it appropriately, so it seems. Okay? I'll see you in the extended, or I'll see you guys soon.